Hey guys, Jason here with a word of the wise. So I was answering a comment and all of a sudden it kind of hit me when I was looking it over of uh, the two witnesses and who destroys them was the beast that comes out of the earth, Apollyon. So Apollyon came in the fifth trumpet. So now we are in the second half of the tribulation now, I believe, and that means that the two witnesses are on the scene. Now, I, I see the two witnesses as possibly being two men, Moses and Elijah, literally walking the earth right now, or Moses is the Old Testament and Eli, you know, Elijah or John being the New Testament, and they are, are bringing the gospel and the prophecies of Jesus to the world right now. And when you look at that, then you could say, well, that's the second beast in Revelation 13. So what is the first beast? The first beast comes out of the sea. And I've done studies and I've shown that in videos, um, how it is a manufactured problem that floods the earth. And that is what the beast rises out of, is out of the sea. And when the, you look at the first trumpets, trying to keep this all straight. If you look at the first trumpets now, the first trumpets affect um, the hail, which falls on the, on the waters. And then the, the sea is the second one. The third one being the rivers and springs, smaller bodies of water. So when you look at Mystery Babylon, who sits on, the, the woman who sits on many waters, the waters are people's nations and tongues. So that the people, the nations and tongues are being struck and it kills a third part of them. Now, I don't know if that means in this, in this definition that a third of man is not redeemable and they are, are killed for that. And that might be spiritually or physically. And so the first beast would be the first four trumpets. And then the second beast resides in the last three. Not saying that the beast is the first four trumpets. That's the angels bringing the, the, the trumpets. So, it just, it's, I'll leave it at that, you know, because then you can see that the two are killed in the great city where the Lord was crucified, which is Sodom and Egypt, spiritually called. And we know where that is. So, just a word to the wise guys. I, I got more on this, but I, I gotta go, and I'm just gonna try to keep this as short as possible. So, God bless, guys. Word to the wise.